they do pluck it to the point where it is definitely giving realistic girl. sis i didn't know she was gonna snap like that like it looks good like it looks really good you know you doing that shit on purpose baby that better than some water let me serve it baby Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am going to be installing a synthetic wig. It is a lace front wig and it is from the Melted Hairline Collection from Outre. I am going to be installing this wig for you guys on camera. Super, super, super excited. From the ramble and like that, let's just get right into the video. Okay? Miss Mamas, I got it in the Kamaya, Kamiya, Kamaya style in a 22 inch. And Y'all see what my sister's giving, don't play. <laughs> and it is a frontal wig. I'm not gonna say I have not had a frontal wig. Like besides this time, this is like my second time having a frontal wig. Yeah, I'm going to install it for you guys, glueless. And we're gonna see what Miss Kamaya is giving. So straight out of the pack, this is what my sis is giving. Giving straight out of the pack. It does look like there is like some plucking going on. I already have pre-defined the part which i'm super super grateful for we're gonna go in and just define that a little bit more so that way it's realistic look at that stuff out of here don't need that at all okay in the inside it does have the elastic band for the glueless straight out of the pack um she giving synthetic but we're gonna see what it's giving once I put her on. Let's go ahead and take this bonnet off. What? What? Pre-braided my hair. It looked like for the next like two months. I'm gonna keep these braids in for the next two months. Of course, before we install our wig, I'm going to be adding my secret formula hair growth oil to my scalp. Yeah. Time that you know, like just period. Like whether you're wearing a protective style or not, you just want to make sure that your scalp is oil and moisturize as much as possible so that way uh during your protective style your hair is taken care of under so in our scalp i, I do kind of got a big head so i gotta like <laughs> slide her back just to do like a ball cap method or nothing like that. Just making sure that I have, you know, the cap on. And I'm gonna just apply a little bit of makeup to my part and also on the parting of the wig so that way when I go ahead and put it on my head, it's already good to go. I'm about to add some on here and before y'all come for me, yes, I'm using a sponge because this is all that I have right now at the moment. So, gather it on my part just to make sure to spread it to as well just to make sure that I am and I'm adding that lace on it and no I'm not putting it on my entire cap it makes no sense make sure I do the same thing to the cap in there on the sides as well so that way when I add it onto my hair it blends seamless so now I'm gonna just go ahead and add her onto my head so plastic band and pull her over like yeah. And then just to make sure that she is in how I want her to lay. Straight down. I'm gonna go ahead and cut these ear tabs here. I don't need that. That way I can go ahead and spray it down. The spray that I'm gonna be using is the Olive Oil Super Hole Wig Grip Spray. This is my first time using this spray, guys, so we're gonna find out together whether it works or not. But the TikTok girlies have been saying that it works, so we're gonna try it. to be cutting four slits so that way I can go ahead and go in with my um, 
razor so that way I can go ahead and cut it. Let's. So I did cut all of the lace off and it is some that is still sticking out. So I'm going to just go back in with the spray and then put my band on and then I will be back. I'm going to take this elastic band off for the second time. Yeah. Girl. All right. Girl. You can't tell me this ain't my real hair. But... I'm definitely looking like um, set it off right now. So I am going to find the part, put the final touches on it so that way it looks good. Just wanted to find the part just a little bit. All right, y'all. Now, part where I needed to be, but I do want it to just lay it a little bit more flat so that way it gives a little more realistic look. It says on here that it is heat resistant fiber. It's safe up to 400 degrees. Figure it out. Now we're gonna figure it out, okay? Let me go ahead and go in. I'll do one side at a time because I can risk one side being fried, but we can't do both. So just add some of my um, wax stick to the side. Go in with the hot comb. Here go nothing. <laughs> Okay, so it is, it is taking the heat. It's taking it. I am like literally scared because, child, if you know how them synthetic wigs did back in the day, you would understand. You would completely understand my fear right now. This is what one side is looking like. And then I'm going to just go ahead and do the same thing to this side. Okay. Oh, be cutesy. Very mindful. Giving uh, like Hollywood housewives vibes. But I'm going to go ahead and just finish the final part with my um foundation and um yeah we're gonna get into it and i'm gonna give y'all my final thoughts on what i think about this hair so period period now this last step really isn't needed but if you want your part to look crisp you want your shit to look like you have a raw wig install you want to make sure that you include this part so this is really just some temporary spray on um it's i'm going to hold my comb in the middle of my part and i'm going to spray it because it's going to define that part and it's going to look like you know the red c parted for this part okay make sure always make sure that you spray it on something first before you go ahead and spray it on your hair because child you don't depending on the nozzle you want to make sure that it's working properly because what you don't want is it to spray everywhere and you messed up your part and yeah so and then just do my test right here i'm going to be looking this way because i do have my mirror right here but i'm just going to hold my um uh, the end of my tip like this just like that's in the part and i'm going to spray it okay so here we go girl don't play with me <laughs> yes part defined <laughs> but yes okay so okay y'all so let's get into this hair so i can give you guys my review on you know what what is given and stuff like that so just straight out of the box i really love how they plugged it um i definitely could have went in and just plugged it a little bit more because you know but if you are somebody who just like really you know ain't really into like doing hair you just want something that you can just slap on and go 
this is perfect like they do pluck it to the point where it is definitely giving realistic girl don't worry about that right there but yeah they do pluck it to the point where it is giving realistic now you do have to keep in mind that it is synthetic hair so don't be expecting bundles don't do not do not expect don't just don't expect that okay um it is very much giving yakky um it's not really like silky but it can definitely pass for like uh 4c hair blown out type of you know that's what it that's what it's that's what it looks like in real life i don't know if you guys can see that um or not but overall sis i didn't know she was gonna snap like that like this hair it looks good like it looks really good um perfect for somebody who is on a budget in total for this hair um i only spent forty dollars y'all like it was only forty dollars and really it was like thirty six dollars and some change because the beauty supply store they were having a sale but if you go on sambeauty.com you can definitely catch the exclusive deals um this once again it is outre let me get the thing uh it is outre's line the melted hairline line in the style kamaya and it's a 22 inch and yes y'all i love it what you guys think um, if you guys want to see a updated video two weeks from out from now so that I can update you guys on how this hair went how it goes how long it lasts I will definitely you know keep you guys updated but what do you guys think like I love <laughs> girl it's giving I just went I just came from the salon like you're not gonna tell me anything different but um yes i love it y'all this is the end of this video if you have not already be sure to like comment and subscribe down below and let me know what videos you guys want to see next from me but until next time you guys 